one other aspect of the uh, proposed bill that caused me concern, and it's the section 19-6003. Uh, it's entitled Complaint and Equitable Relief. My concern is, in this legislation and in other legislation that we're starting to see, we're creating private causes of action. We're creating private cause of action where none existed before. Um, and what do I mean by that? Usually when you have a cause of action, uh, a right to file a lawsuit, it's because trouble found you. You were minding your own business, somebody breached a contract with you. Minding your own business, somebody ran into you in, a, in their car. Trouble found you, you have a cause of action to seek redress. I'm starting to see a pattern in bills that are arriving to this body or, or across the rotunda where private cause of action are inserted in the bills allowing people to seek trouble, to find trouble and pursue it and to litigate it and to fill our courtrooms, which will then prevent uh, our citizens who have trouble that found them from being able to pursue their rights and remedies. So it's a concern of mine. Uh, I also dislike the fact that in that private cause of action, um, it also provides more power to the Attorney General's office where none existed in this arena. Um, also an increase of government oversight and uh, bureaucracy. So for those reasons, Ms. Uh, Mr. President, I'll be voting no on this bill. Thank you.